I want to make a little video out in the middle and yonder at Walmart parking lot. People start coming around. The basket guy was here a second ago making a bunch of noise. There's an old dude over there unloading his stuff, groceries. Looks like a bunch of canned corn that must be on sale. Anyway, this is honestly going to be a short vlog for once. I just came to Walmart, left the kiddo at the house. She wanted to stay there. She didn't want to come. I need to get a refill, and I also need to change pharmacies. There's only two pharmacies in town. The other one was convenient because they had a drive-in. But there was always 95% of the time, there's like three or four cars, <clears throat> and you're waiting 45 minutes. So it's just like standing in line at Walmart for your meds. So... Plus, they're not open on Sunday, so they're going to transfer Sarah's, and please don't part by me and my stuff tomorrow. Hopefully, there won't be any issues. There shouldn't be. Um, anyway, we were supposed to go to Marshall, Texas, which is just less than an hour and a half from here, to meet up with the friend that came down a couple weeks ago, and we had, came up, and we had lunch together. Um, we were going to have lunch again. He is a welder, and he um, goes around town and does jobs and stuff. And apparently he has worked. You now he's going to bring the basket, and he's going to hear me. I'm so shy. i got to put the phone down. Okay, I'm back. Anyway, I'm shy. Anyway, um, so he did a bunch of welding. Sorry if that was too loud. Um, at an Italian restaurant. And he gets free food there. So he's been inviting us for at least a year. Um, Sarah and I. Sarah really is, you know, she doesn't really want to make a trip. She didn't feel good. Her dad was going to be home. <clears throat> Most Sundays he doesn't work. Some he does. Um, and uh, he was going to let her hang out over there. I only would have been gone about four hours. Maybe a little bit longer. But um, anyway... That didn't work out. He has to meet with his brother. I, my stomach's kind of mm, iffy. And since Sarah didn't want to go, you know. Um, so, yeah, pizza another time, I guess. Um, oh, inside Walmart, I ran into a nurse um, in one of the Texarkana hospitals. And... Um, She's always been so sweet. We chat a little bit, and she invited me to her church, which is, which is an LDS church, which I used to go to an LDS church. I was baptized to LDS years and years and years ago. Um, but I just it's just not for me anymore. But she's so sweet, and we chatted a little bit, chatted about the kiddo and, you know, stuff like that. And um, I just got a couple things with the refills, just... Um, some donuts. Shh, don't tell nobody. Um, I don't know if Sarah will eat hers because my chocolate donuts are touching her regular glazed donuts. Anyway. Um, chips, hot dogs, and something else. I won't bother showing you. Uh, cheese for Sarah's pasta because, as y'all know, she is a pasta eater. That's her thing. Um, and that's really... That's really it. It's cloudy here. It's We only got like a 30-40% chance of rain. I wish, you know, it has poured and poured. And I have a white car. And for some reason, it is not washing my car. So I think I'm going to have to break down and actually pay money on the first of the month to get my car washed. Um, yeah. So, what else? I was going to say something else, but it just left my brain. Oh, I'm so proud of myself. <clears throat> I, had, I try not to do too many swaps because the shipping, I don't mind doing them when I'm physically able to. And here are the last, I don't want to jinx it, for the last couple, three weeks, I, except for little things, I have felt really good. Um, no issues with my MS, my balance my heart I did go to the ER once but it was fixed so I didn't even have to stay um, and I just feel good even mentally I'm, I'm kind of in a better place I guess um, but yeah so I try not to sign up or do too many swaps with people 
and um, I was going to do six, six or seven, six I think, and one is going to be later on because she had a horrible, horribly devastating thing happen in her family, so that's just later on in the year or whenever, that's not an issue, but I have all but one, um, not including hers, done. So, and I'm so proud of myself because usually after a couple of projects, I'm, you know, my, my nerve damage in my hands is giving me grief and just um, mentally not feeling it. And I have just been like in embellishments and wands. I'm addicted to the glitter paint. It has these beautifully iridescent shreds of whatever in it. And I'm just putting that all over my wands. I may paint my whole body with it. I don't know. It is my new addiction. Um, it is from Folk Art. And I can't remember. Is that Hobby Lobby? Because I looked at Walmart. And the list, I meant that is the most beautiful Airedale ever I've ever seen in my life. Which I've only seen like a whole thing in But anyway. They're big too. Big as a German Shepherd, y'all. Huskier. But anyway, sorry, got distracted. I'm so easily distracted. I'm like a four-year-old. But anyway, um, I'm going to buy, buy the gallon, I think, and just paint my walls and everything else with it. I love it. Um, Y'all are going to get sick of receiving things or seeing pictures on my Instagram of it. Anyway, that's all I got to say. I just wanted to babble a little bit. Uh, I'm going to head home and um, spend the day with Sarah, hopefully. I'd like for it to rain, but maybe it'll hold off when we can go to the park or something. She's in the mood to leave, but not in the mood to do little things like sit in the park and stuff. I don't know. <sighs> Kids. But anyway, y'all have a wonderful Sunday. God bless. Do something good for somebody. Take care. Bye.